Elon Musk, a guy with a net worth of $160 billion, now lives in a home worth half as much as the car he drives. And this could actually be a solution to this crazy and unaffordable housing market that we're in right now. So we're gonna be taking a look at Elon's current living situation, how these strange homes work, and how they address four major issues in today's housing market. So for some context here, in 2020, Elon Musk went on this anti-materialistic selling spree where he sold seven homes. Poor guy only had seven homes to sell. And then after that, he moved from California over to Texas where there's no state income tax. Of course, a big change from California's highest income tax rate in the entire country. So the move wasn't too surprising, especially with the new Cybertruck facility being in Austin, Texas. But what was surprising about this is Elon then took to Twitter and said, my primary home is literally a $50,000 house in Boco Chica slash Starbase that I rent from SpaceX. It's kind of awesome though. Now this obviously begs the question, what kind of a house is on the SpaceX site and only worth $50,000? Like I said, that's half the price of the car he drives, a Tesla Model X. Then the price starts to make sense when you find out that his car could actually tow this house and move it wherever. That's because this house is called a boxable, a new type of modular home. And if you haven't heard of boxable, they provide what's called dwelling units. And they probably call it this because they know it's not really a fully fledged house, but boxable provides these portable homes that can be towed anywhere and unfolded in just a few hours. SpaceX actually plans to expand living arrangements at their Starbase in Texas using these boxable units. And then on top of this, boxable will soon provide more modules for expanding current units or creating different styles of homes, almost like building with Lego or or you remember on Sims where you could build a house one room at a time? Kind of the same idea. So maybe SpaceX will run with this idea and we'll have our first 100% portable, movable, and modular neighborhood pop up on Mars once we gotta, we gotta get to Mars first, but maybe that'll happen. Thanks for tuning in. And if you enjoyed this content, make sure you subscribe to the main channel as well right here.